Hi and welcome back to MRTV. My name is Sebastian Ang and in this video I'm going to show you how to install the Resident Evil 7 VR mod for PC. The one that has motion controls now, which is incredible. First of all, you gotta buy it from Steam. It's gonna set you back $20 or you could probably get a code somewhere and get it cheaper. Once you've done that, head over to this page. Now, this is the Prey Dog Resident Evil 7 page. And well, you can look for it on Google or you can simply find it down in the description of this video below. Here you'll find lots of links that you don't understand, but you don't have to worry about those links because actually you only want to go to the releases section. And well, I put the link down below. If you directly want to go there, that's fine. In this section, in the releases section, what you got to do, you simply got to download the re7.zip file. That is really everything that you need to do here and nothing else. That is the file that you need, so simply download it. Next, we're going to make the game more beautiful with a mod. So go to Nexus Mods, the link's down in the description of this video. And well, you're going to download the 4K HD upscaled textures. Click on manual download here. And then go to the following files. So RE7 4K Upscale Textures Full Part 1, download this file. And also do download Part 2. You're going to need that later as well. But in this video, I'm only going to show it to you for Part 1, but do the same with Part 2. And for using the Nexus mods, you will need an account there. So before you do everything that I'm showing you here, you need to make an account. All right. Now, find the RE7 zip that you just downloaded and copy it. Now go to the Resident Evil 7 folder. For me, it's volume E, and then it is Steam Library, Steam Apps, Common, and then here Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. Here, paste the file into it, this RE7 zip, and extract it and extract it exactly here into this folder. So I'm using 7-zip to make that happen. That's a free tool that you could download. All right, that's it. That's it. <laughs> yeah, unbelievable. So now copy the texture file that you've downloaded and do the same thing. Paste it into the Resident Evil 7 folder, the same that you've been using in a moment. Exactly. So here it is, common, and then Resident Evil 7, paste, and then next extract it exactly there. Now, when you extract it, it's going to ask you, hey, do you want to override these files? You're going to see it in a moment when I extract it here. And for this, do yes to all here in this moment. Yep, that's it. And again, you have to do the same thing with part two that you've just seen. I'm not going to show it to you here in this video, but do the same thing with part two from Nexus Mods. And that is everything. Now, start the game. In Steam VR, go to your games library, not the VR library, because they don't know yet it's a VR game now. Click on play in theater, because now they're still thinking you're going to do play some 2D game and the magic is going to happen. As you can tell, now it starts as a VR game. Yes, congratulations. It was so simple to make this happen. And actually, now you even have motion controls with Resident Evil 7 in VR, and you did not have this in the PSVR version, which is really incredible. So this is an incredible mod. It is for free, and the game is a AAA game, and many say that this is the best horror game in VR. Now, if you know me, I cannot play horror games. I cannot do it. It's too bad for me. Anyways, in this mod, you will be able to see your hands. You can move them. You can have great gunplay with these motion controls. And here are the hands. Now, if you point with the right hand to the left hand, there is a special menu going to open and you have to try it first. I also had to try it here, but then a special menu opens and that is this mod menu. So you're going to see it now, hopefully, <laughs> in a moment, 
you're going to see it. And here, there it is. In this mod menu, you can have some settings that affect this mod. So this is a fantastic mod now with motion controls. Do play it if you're into horror games. This is one of the best horror games in virtual reality. Yep, and so I'm walking along here looking for that horror house. <laughs> and yeah, this is probably the most that you will ever see me play this title because I truly cannot play horror games in VR. It's too real for me. I don't even enjoy horror movies, so horror VR games, no, that is not what I like to do. Anyways, do you like horror games? And have you already installed this mod, this Resident Evil 7 mod? Please do let me know in the comment section. Do tell me if you enjoyed it more than I did. <laughs> well, in this part here. And yeah, I'm looking forward to hear from you. So, what I did, here's the house now. You shouldn't go inside, there's just trouble inside. <laughs> um, at least I tried to get inside. Yeah, it was closed, sorry. Nothing that I could do. And I even rang the bell here now. Next, exactly, I rang the bell. But then I was simply too scared that somebody would open and left. <laughs> All right, so if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and do leave a comment. And of course, if you've not yet subscribed to MRTV yet, absolutely do that now and click on the bell button so that you don't miss any of our upcoming videos and now i say goodbye and i'm looking forward to see you in the next episode until then bye bye